Hey guys, what's up? I'm Boyka and on this video I'm gonna be going over the horn locations. The horns are gonna be these ones over here and these are gonna be material that you can basically level up your character. So uh, this one is the lowest level which is going to be a 2 star one and this one is called heavy horn. Then we have the 3 star one which is called black bronze horn and finally black crystal horn. So these are all the three items that we have like the materials. And the first one you can get basically by any large helichurl, it drops by any of them, doesn't matter the level. When we move on to the 3 star one, this one we can only get from a, a large helichurl that is uh, level 40 and above. And finally the 4 star one, the helichurl has to be above level 60, 60 or above as you can see right here. And it can also be crafted by giving basically 3 of these. And this can also be crafted by giving 3 of these 2 star ones to be able to craft a 3 star one as well. So what you want to do right here to be able to find these large helicerals is by basically coming up here to the book. There is going to be like a book on the corner of your screen on the right side. You're going to come over here to the book and go to enemies. And then you're going to click to all right here on the arrow and click on elite enemies. And then you're going to scroll down a little bit and you're going to find this one right here, which is called Metatrol. And from him we can get uh, horns and also some masks. And if you scroll down a little more, you can see this one right here, which is called Helichral Shiftain. And from this one, you can also get some masks right here and also the horns as well. So what you want to do right here is by basically, if you want to go to this one, this one is a little uh, easier to kill. They come in like three different variants, I think, uh, or maybe like two different variants. One of them has a shield. The other one uh, doesn't have a shield, but has like an axe. And there is going to be one also in Dragon Spine, the new location. He's going to be frozen this time, like the ice version of him. So we have, I think, three different uh, versions of him. And you can, what you want to do over here is like come over here and click Navigate. And after you click Navigate, they're going to show you like the first location, which is going to be probably this one. I'm not sure if it's going to be this one on you, but on me is this one right here, which is going to be right next to the Thousand Winds Temple. So what you want to do right here is basically teleport to like the closest teleport waypoint. It can be uh, this domain right here, this one or this one. I'm just going to teleport this teleport waypoint and I'm going to show you right now. So after you've teleported right here, the location of that uh, enemy is going to be on your minimap. As you can see right there up on the minimap right here, it shows you where it is located. So you can turn around or like just go forward wherever the enemies is. I'm just going to go like behind right here and he's going to be somewhere. I think he's like close to the road. So he has to be like somewhere right here. Maybe right under me, right, right here, right now. So as you can see, he's sh sitting right here on the tree, and there's like a camp right next to it. They're usually sitting right in like near camps or just like walking around. And as you can see, this one right here has a shield. And to be able to break that shield, you will need like a pyro character, like I have clear right here. So I'm just gonna go here and attack his shield to burn it down. I'm also gonna use my fischl bird to be able to deal some extra damage. The E of my razor, and he's already dead. And as you can see right here, we got the heavy horn. And the heavy horn is the two star one, but you can get it all the way up to the four star, depending on the level again of the helichurl. If it's below level 60, you won't be able to get it. Uh, if it's if it's like your helichurl, lar large helichurl is below level 60, then you're gonna be able to only get like the three star and two star. But what you do after you kill that first one is go back to the book right here, go back to enemies, elite enemies, scroll down, go to this one, and as you can see right here, the level of it changed right now. Uh, I, I it, it was lower before, I think, it, I know, and now it changed. So what you want to do right here is like click on him again and go to navigate. And you're going to see that the next location on me is on Storm Terror's layer. So I'm just going to go right here now. So again, after you're here, the location is going to be shining on the minimap, as you can see up there. And it actually, the, uh, the, the uh, this place right here, if you spawn right here, there's going to be like a really good transportation uh, place right here. As you can see, I'm flying up. So I'm just going to like fly up here and like it's going to be like a... I'm not sure if, if he's like up there because if he's up there, it's going to be a struggle. But nope, he's down there right now. And as you can see, this one is also a shield one. He also has a shield. So you will need again a pyro character here. So let's see. Oh, he hit me in the air. Nice. So here again, I'm going to use my police attacks and my official's bird, Oz, and attacking the shield. And as you can see, before even the shield melted, he died again. So I'm just going to kill these mouse over here. 
And I, I can already see that we got like the force. Oh, nope, it's the. Oh, okay. The purple, I thought it was uh, like the four star one, but no. So we got here, as you can see, I got the level uh, two star one and three star one. When I saw the purple color, I thought I got the four star one, but it was actually an artifact. So they can drop artifacts as well, but it's like very rare to drop artifacts. Just killing these extra ones over here. Getting my arrowhead as well. So these large heal trolls most of the time are gonna have some other heal trolls around them. They're gonna be like archers or uh, it can be shamans as well. So after clearing the second one, just like the repeat the process like before, go to elite enemies, go to this one right here, click navigate again. And after they're gonna show you like the other location. And I think in this area right here, there are like two different ones. So I'm just gonna go there right now and see. So they're supposed to be somewhere around here. And as you can see, they're like right there. And these are the two other one, the, the two other versions, which like one of them, as you can see right there, has like a just axe, and the other one has a shield. So what they're gonna do right here is like basically attack me immediately, because I'm like too close to them now. I'm just gonna heal with my barber over here before I fight them. Uh, on both of these right here, I'm just gonna use like my please attack again because one of them is like a shield one, so I wanna like kind of like nail down the shield. And just like that, the first one is dead, and I got only the two-star one right here. And let's see what kind of one I'm gonna get from this one right here. Just real quick. Use the shield there. The shield is destroyed, as you can see right here. So they're gonna like charge at you like this, so just like try to dodge it. If you like just like uh, dash to the side, you're gonna be able to like dodge it really easily. Okay, that hit me there. Spawn Oz again. And just like that, and let's see, I got the mask and the heavy horn again, a two-star one. But this is basically how to farm these ones over here. As I, as I said before, you can also farm the mask from them. And here I got like the three-star one, which is like the max level. But uh, this is basically how to farm the horns. You can either farm it from the hitter troll, which is like easier to farm. Or either from the hill troll chieftain. This one is a little harder to farm because he uh, he's like a bigger version of the older hill trolls. He's like the biggest hill troll there is, and he also has like a shield up, uh, and you have to first destroy the shield, then uh, kill, be able to kill it. But this is basically how to farm them. Yeah, you can farm them from uh, him as well if you uh, if you like, because there's like gonna be uh, be a limit for you to like farm these uh, meter trolls right here. And after you're done farming them, then you can go to the uh, hill troll shifting if you want, if you're like so desperate for horns. But this is basically how to farm them. If the video was helpful, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more videos like this. And I'm gonna see you on the next one. Bye bye. Take care.